the blue elderberry or the Sambucus nigra is found in sunny communities such as the riparian woodlands like Polly Canyon. It is also found on streamsides, riverbanks, and cliffsides. The plant habit of the blue elderberry is a shrub or small tree. Its philodoxy includes oppositely pinnately compound leaves in that fashion. They have a pinnate venation and elliptic shape. The apices are acuminate and the bases are acute. The leaves are divided into three to nine toothed leaflets, which are serrate and have plain margins with glabrous surface features. In the late spring to early summer, the blue elderberry blooms large flat-topped clusters of many small cream-colored flowers. From July to October, dark blue wax-covered berries begin to grow. The fruits, which are relished by birds, are also eaten by abdominal Californians and are still used today for making things such as pies, jelly, and wine. The cooked leaves and roots, as well as the decorations of the flowers, are used medically as external compresses to relieve soreness and inflammation. The blue elderberry is pollinated by butterflies, after which three to five seeds form, which birds will then eat. It is also important to know that the berries are toxic when consumed raw. The Aboriginal Californians removed the spongy internal pith of the new stems to make whistles, flutes, and other musical instruments. Coincidentally, Carolus Linnaeus named the genus Sambucus after a Greek musical instrument called the Sambuca, made from the wood of a related species. <laughs>